Hello everyone, welcome to the next session of ANSYS Workbench tutorial. In this session, we will be discussing about a cantilever beam which is subjected to uniformly distributed load. In the previous class, we have already discussed about cantilever beam which was subjected to point load. So let's get started. I'll go to static structural and double click on it. I'll rename the file as cantilever underscore UDL. I'll go to geometry, right click, new design modular geometry. Now I'll go to XY plane, look at sketching and like in the previous videos, I'm going to draw a rectangle and give it some dimensions see the horizontal value is 50 vertical value is 15 I'll go for extrude the geometry is chosen I'll apply a depth of 5 meter and generate this is my simple geometry Next, I'll go to model and double click on it. I'll go to mesh sizing. I'll change course to find update. Now I'll go to analysis settings. Since this is cantilever beam, on one side I'll apply fixed and I will be applying UDL on the stop portion. Right click, insert force. I'll change vector to component, the direction is Z, I'll apply load of 2000 Newton. I'll go to solution, right click, insert deformation directional, I want to see the effect in Z axis, right click, insert stress equivalent. Right click, insert strain equivalent. I'll go to solution, right click, solve. I'll go to directional deformation. And I'll animate this. Next, I'll go to equivalent stress on the cantilever. And this is the equivalent strain obtained. You can compare your solution with the cantilever beam which is subjected to a point load at one end and fixed at the other end. With this I end this session. I hope you have understood the process for solving this type of a beam analysis. See you in the next session. Thank you. Mm -hmm.